Sega. What is a bit damn? I shouldn't be. Let's play with this one. Disney Interactive. But uh, let's play is my passion. Traveler's Tales. Have to let's play whether I have the voice or not. Psygnosis. If you can't let's play, what can you do? Play the games without talking and recording and putting it on YouTube? Hmm? Welcome to Let's Play Toy Story on Sega Mega Drive or Genesis, whichever, whichever you fancy. And a uh, little bit I have to say about here. Um, I already made a walkthrough without uh, without commentary on another channel, and I played that with. Uh, starting with Yahoo on one try and collected the rest of them throughout the game but um I have to make sure that I don't have to save state too much or load state I might uh, save state when I'm taking breaks or possibly between levels to make sure that I actually get through the game and get the recording done so I'm gonna choose as many lives as I can possibly and uh, start here to the end of the game, and not too far beyond that. You read that, uh, I'm going to talk about something else. Uh, Toy Story was uh, my, one of my favorite games when I was a kid. That's what I, what I grew up with. I haven't seen the movies, but the game's great, and it's basically the movie already. Um, uh, Toy Story, Cool Spot, and uh, Streets of Rage, those were the games that I... The very few games that I actually remember passing when I was a kid. I had a lot of games, a lot of fun games. Many of them were pretty difficult. Ever played Mickey Mania or Dick Tracy? Fun games, but uh, towards the end. Uh, quite hellish. But I, I beat Toy Story, so... That's why it was one of my favorite games. And, um... I haven't. I have Sonic games, but I haven't beat the uh, final boss in any of them. Kind of sad. That's what kind of gamer I am. Can't even beat games. But um, yeah, that's why Toy Story was one of my favorite games. And there's some. When I made my wall through, people told me that they they thought Toy Story was one of the hardest games they ever played when I, they were kids. And, um, I just couldn't believe that. I mean, was it the only game they had? Was it like they had Toy Story and some Barbie games, and that was it? Well, there's hit points to collect, so that. Damn you, helicopter. Move! Why, why are some toys trying to stop me from completing? My mission and some toys don't. Flies, I can understand their box, but like helicopters, they're kind of annoying me. Damn it! And that I just jumped there and it hit me. Well, anyway, there are some t tough, tough bits in Toy Story, like the claw and especially Roller Bob. Those levels are. Oh. Nightmare. Oh, that's it. And I lost it. Oh, damn it. Well, there are still chances to get more hit points. But, um, yeah. I couldn't believe why some people thought that this was the hardest game they've ever played. Ooh. Big Tracy might be the hardest game I've ever played on Sega, so... Honestly, that's... That game is just... Nightmare. First level done. Did I have something to say? Probably not much. If this is going to be great commentary. Uh, I'm losing my voice and I don't have anything to tell you. And I... Uh, don't... I'm not too good at the game, probably. I try to play as well I, as I can in the beginning, but I will stop collecting the stars later on because it starts to get 
a bit too tricky that uh, like um, the boss battle and uh, nightmare boss levels or bosses <sighs> the stars in those are just oh, horrible too it, they are possible to collect but pretty difficult and stars are what are what life is made of because their hit points and they give you life if you collect all 50. Collect stars. Anyway, this is timed level. But, uh, actually, too difficult. It's time, but fairly easy. Uh, you can see that I didn't let Crowbar, whatever his name, I, I can't actually remember. I haven't seen the movie, so I don't, I only know the characters. From when they uh, show the credits in the end. As you can see, I just saved time there. Because now the Rex is coming, I don't have to go back and forth. Because the, uh, they continue going around the level and they, they don't stop at those obstacles, they stop at that um, bucket there. So it, um, it's a waste of time if uh, I'll just leave, let him go. I still have plenty of time. Oh no. Because I do want the stars early on. I have to be the, here to actually get the, all the stars. As you can see, I still have about a minute left, and I'm in the end of the level now. I just have to wait for the Rocky. I think that one was it. That his name? I can't remember. I still have only four hit points, but uh, in the next level, I think uh, you can call it some. Of course, that means you don't actually lose hit points. And like I said, I'm I'm not a good let's player. I can't speak and play at the same time, or play too well, or talk too well. You know, it's I can't do both. Uh, I cannot do both pretty well, but not at the same time. At the same time, it's just horrible mess. It's this. It's an LP. Anyway. Somebody asked me if in this next level, because you're racing bars, somebody uh, or more people than one have asked, asked me if you can actually beat bars in the race. No, you can't. The, the point of the story is that uh, bars wins. And it's another big spoiler. <laughs> it happens in the movie. And um, it's a set race, it has to be end that like that, otherwise Wo if Woody had won then Buzz wouldn't have been all that cool you know, Wo Woody would have shown that he was right and Buzz was just uh, another toy not too great couldn't fly <sighs> uh, that didn't happen, uh, I think in the movie Buzz just kind of hit some stunts it. It's worth wasting one hit point to get that star if you're collecting all of them. Because you get another life. And that's a bit better than hit points because hit points you can collect more. Ooh, that skill. So that Tyler, petty douchebag. Huh. I just love uh, uh, referencing other LPs and LPs. I haven't done too bad in this level yet, but I probably there's a hit point someplace where you it's just a hoax. You can't collect a hit point without getting hit. Have to. I remember hitting that shark a lot. It's always like 
sneak, I sneak, I snuck up on me. Yeah, that. That hit point is pretty difficult to collect, actually, because it, uh, the helicopter doesn't move too far away. 